I'm going to see if I can explain this without the math teacher in me getting irritated because every time I make this video, it's like I am so irritated because the income may be higher, okay? But the statistics are pretty much the same across the United States. So the percentage of households that make $200,000 or more is somewhere between 1 and 5%. Now, you have some outliers where you have a lot of concentrated wealth, but for the vast majority of the United States, the percentage of people that make that kind of money is low. So even if you have a billionaire, like, you know what I'm saying? It's not a lot of billionaires. There are not a lot of hundred million, hundred millionaires, like people that make 100 million. Those, there, it's just not a lot of them. In fact, it's a statistical you know what I'm not even going to go into all of that this is what I know the real world and TikTok often collides in a way that lets me know that people didn't pay attention in school they just didn't pay attention in school and then it collides in a way that lets me know people don't go outside people do not go outside like they are on this app and they think what they see on this app is like reality and it's not it's just not like the real world and reality often clash on this. I see it all the time. I see it when men start telling women like how to be and what you can do and what you can't do. There's a guy that I follow all the time. His name is Dan, Dan from HR. And I see him like bitching and complaining about it like every day because he knows what he's talking about. But he has to argue against people that like watch the video and now they think that they're an expert. Like the real world and social media are not the same. They're just not the same. This is a fantasy. There are not a lot of people that are making $200,000 a year relative to the number of people that are working. And then when you add being a black woman, well, just race in general. And gender, the odds of a woman that is making $200,000 a year, finding a man that is also making $200,000 a year, and them liking each other, the odds are low. It's not zero, but it's low, and it's just a reality. Not that it can't happen, but statistically speaking, the odds are low. God. 